Fee, thanks a lot. We've got 100% of the precincts reporting Democrat Denise Garner in an upset over incumbent Republican Charlie Collins for state representative District 84 with over 55% of the vote. And we are pleased to be joined this morning uh, by Representative elect Denise Garner uh, joining us in studio. Uh, Denise, thank you for joining us and congratulations thank to you. you. Very much. Um, uh, going up against an incumbent is always a, a, a tall order, especially it's almost like you're an underdog going in. What was your strategy uh, throughout your campaign and, and really? pulling off this victory. You know, I think one of the reasons that I ran in the first place mm -hmm. is that um, I felt like our legislators were not listening to their voters, mm -hmm. to their constituents. And so um, our strategy was to make sure that we hit every neighborhood in the district and talk to friends and neighbors about their concerns and their ideas. And we did that. And it's really a grassroots program, as we've seen nationwide with early voting. How surprised were you Absolutely. in seeing just a lot of people getting to the polls early? You know, I, I'm still in shock, <laughs> actually. Um, you know, like you said, going up against an, an incumbent, and and we still live in a very conservative district, and so I'm still I'm still surprised. But um, we, like I said, we've been working a year, and it's been a grassroots campaign back to retail politics. We've had a great team that worked very very hard. And, um, and, and we knocked on doors, and we called, and we texted, and we wrote postcards, um, very much back to retail politics, making sure that we hit every friend and neighbor and, and talk to them and listen to their concerns. So as you speak with the viewers who yep. you represent, District 84, what are some of the issues that you'll bring to the table to the state legislature? Well, like I said, the the um, the job of the representative is to do that for their for their voters, and um, our constituents have have spoken loud and clear that they do not like Act 562, which is the guns guns on campus law, which became guns everywhere law, and um, it was one of those bills that was passed in a hurry without much scrutiny, and is a dangerous law, and that's the thing that every one of our households talk about. And so that's the first thing, is to make sure we look at that law, that we look at um, how we can make it safer, how we can make it more reasonable, how we can make it more um, or less confusing. All right. Yeah. All right. Well, we appreciate your time coming in this morning. Thank Absolutely. You very much. Congratulations once again. Thank you. All right. Our coverage of the 2018 midterm elections continues when we come back, but as we head to break, here is a look at more results from last night. Stay with us.